guys, on this Freebie Friday, I'm just gonna show you what my makeup situation looks like now. Um, it has downsized significantly in the past. Well, I've been doing makeup since 2007, so it is significantly downgraded since then. As so you know, I used to freelance, so I had a lot more stuff in my kit. Um, but this is just stuff that I use now, and yeah, so I have this little mirror thing here. Um, it's kind of crappy. I need to get a better one, but it is what it is. Uh, I also did my nails. This is Elf in Nude. Anyway, this is my little, um, I have this cup here that says Night Owl that I keep my larger brushes in. So I've got fluffy brushes in here. I've got my Kat Von D mirror and I have another little leopard print mirror just in case I need it. Got some perfumes and body sprays. Um, also some perfumes, perfumes, and then this whole thing in here is perfume. And then I have some of my smaller brushes here. I have a little bit more of my larger like face brushes here. Um, I have this whole red set. I have no idea where it came from, but this whole entire red set um, is back there. And then I have some of my smaller brushes. And then I've got my beauty blender, which needs to be cleaned, <laughs> my kabuki, and another little sponge that I use for um, applying powder. So on the other side, I have this setting spray here, which doesn't really work. It's like a primer setting spray. It comes out like in a stream, so I don't use it. I need to get rid of it. I have this brush cleaner from BH Cosmetics. I really, really like this for spot cleaning. And then I have this hyaluronic um, spray. This is toner, and then I have just like some cotton swabs, some cotton balls. I have some little um, like cotton pads. So I have all that there. And then I have this little thing here, which on the top has all of my primers, some setting sprays, um, my foundation, um, little sample size ones. As you know, I really like the trial and the sample size ones because I don't use them that much. So yeah, this is where all that kind of lives on top. In this drawer, I have some concealers. This is all like little lip balms. This drawer is eyelash, eyebrow, utensils, and um, like eyelash glue, glitter glue, stuff like that. This one is lip scrubs with a little spatula. This one is mascaras. This is liquid eyeliner. This is all of my pencils, all of my eyeliners, and like jumbo eye pencils. And down here is all of my brow products that I'm currently using. Over here I have some extra foundations that I don't use anymore because they're not my shade. And I have this little alcohol thing and then one back here for acetone which is empty which I need to refill. Alright, I'm going to take you over to my Alex drawer and show you everything in there. Okay, so I have two of the Alex drawers and the Linman top and I got the larger Linman top. But this is the only side that I have makeup in. Uh, I used to have it in both sides but I have downsized that much that I don't need to have both sides full. Um, and then I just started watching... Um, <laughs> tidying up with Marie Kondo. So here is my declutter bucket. So this is all lipsticks and face palettes and things of the nat of that nature that I have pulled out and I'm going to get rid of. So um, this top drawer is all of my lipsticks that I decided to keep. So um, I'm not going to go through every single solitary lipstick that I have unless you just want me to, but um, yes, I still have NARS in my collection even though they are no longer cruelty free because they decided to start selling in China, um, but I purchased these when they were and I'm not going to go ahead and throw them out. Um, I did purge my entire collection of my MAC cosmetics because I was a big MAC junkie and um, yeah, so all that stuff is gone now. I have two of these little like lipstick things that you can put your lipsticks in um, and they used to both be full <laughs> and I just keep the other one because I know I'm going to refill it with like other ones. So yeah, this uh, section used to be a lot like fuller and it used to be all down in here as well because I had everything in their boxes and just recently I cluttered, decluttered and got rid of all of my boxes. Um, ooh, that kind of matches my, these kind of match my nails. <laughs> um, so yeah, I have a lot of stuff. Fenty is just blinging off the light here. So this is my newest purchase, which is the Fenty Beauty, um, uncensored lip paint. Oh my goodness. This stuff is amazing. I'm going to put it over here because it keeps like reflecting. Anyway, um, so I've got Storybook Cosmetics. I've got Deep Benoit. I've got Tarte. Um, I've got Sugar Pill, I've got Makeup Monsters Cosmetics, which they're no longer Makeup Monsters Cosmetics. I don't know what they are now, but anyway, 
Um, and then underneath all of these ones on the top is two layers of Jeffree Star Cosmetics. Um, yeah, these are all liquid lips in here. Um, in here I have, um, looks like I've got some Too Faced. Yeah, I've got some Too Faced. I've got some Elf. Um, what else is in here? Uh, Beauty Bakery. I've got some NARS. Some, some what else is in here? <laughs> I don't even know what all is in there. Um, I did just go through this, trust me. Um, this is Kat Von D and Elf and uh, Ciate Glitter Flips. These are all kind of like, some of these are liquid lips, some of these are creams, some of these are lip glosses, stuff like that. So yeah, this is basically all of my lip products. Um, I have my, some of my lip liners down here. I need to get... Um, I need to get some more lip liners and then I have some little lip brushes here if I get a product in and I want to try it out and I don't end up liking it I can sell it and I won't like mess up the, the what do you call it so I'm gonna put this back where it belongs and I'm gonna close this drawer up so prior to me doing this I had like a huge storybook cosmetics box right here then I had the huge Jeffree Star box like on top of all of this and then all of this was like neatly packaged and everything which I really do like the packaging but I gotta let it go and if you hear any whining, it's because this one is playing with the dogs under the door. Anyway, um, so yeah, that is the top drawer on my Alex drawer. This drawer is face palettes, um, highlighters, face powders, um, things of that nature. So I've got blushes over here. I've got some highlighters and some blushes and some Kat Von D blushes. Um, highlighter these are like from these are from NARS and from elf um, we've got some tarts some milk Sonia Kashuk uh, and then I've got some some Too Faced some Anastasia Beverly Hills I actually have the Moonchild palette coming I got it from the Distache group I shouldn't be on that group <laughs> um, a BC um, Beauty Concepts Uniglow highlighting palette BH Cosmetics nude blush palette um, my favorite uh, contour palette some this I really like this like warm nudes like shimmer brick from physicians formula I really like this one um, these are all Jeffree Star cosmetics these are just random face powders we've got um, oh I still have some Mac in here um, Mac prep and prime uh, this stuff was really expensive so I'm gonna kill this off before I get rid of it so um, and then I've got my Kat Von D powder here. So that's pretty much that. And that one has significantly downsized as well. My eyeshadow palettes. This one is rather full. And I'm still debating whether or not I'm going to keep some of the things that are in here. So I have like Urban Decay Electric palette. I have the Too Faced um, Nikki Tutorials palette. Uh, let's see. This is the BH Cosmetics Galaxy Chic palette. Urban Decay Full Spectrum. Uh, this one is the 120 color palette, uh, and I think down at the bottom underneath that one, got my blood sugar palette here. Um, this is the Shan XO palette, Graveyard Girl palette, Pretty Poison palette. This is a um, Lunatic Cosmetics Labs palette that I made. Um, NYX Cosmetics, got Manic Panic, uh, Lunar Beauty, Jeffree Star. Yes, they're right next to each other because that's how it fits. Um, I've got my ABH palettes here, Modern Renaissance, Subculture. Uh, the only Naked palette that I've ever purchased is the original Naked palette. Um, again, here's the Blood Sugar palette. And then you lift these up, and this is the Storebook Cosmetics Witchcraft, what is it, Witchcraft and Wizardry palette or something like that. Um, I'm keeping it in that because I just like the way it looks. And then these are all of my... Um, Pigments in this one. This is all just random Jessie's Girl pigments. Um, this is like an elf. Um, I don't know if I'm going to keep this or not, but it's a eyeshadow palette. It's really pretty. Um, concrete Minerals back there. And then I've got uh, some, I think these are all Ulta. And then I've got just Milani, Elf, um, Urban Decay. Yeah, all NYX. Just random random ones in there so this one was again way way full and I needed to make room for the new palettes that I purchased which was the Jeffree Star um, blood sugar palette and then I have a couple other palettes that are coming that I will show you guys in a future video so that is my eyeshadow palette drawer and this one is eyelashes and 
Uh, I've got a little mini flat iron here, a little headband, some makeup wipes and hyaluronic acid wipes, and then all of those are hairsprays that are different colors. We have white, we have black, we have green, we have um, these little tubes are gray, ghostly gray, which I never got around to using, but anyway, that's what is in the fourth drawer, and then in the fifth drawer, we have, um, yes, a fork. <laughs> um, these are all my um, SFX products that are not, that I don't keep in my little kit. Um, so yeah, I've got my blood gels in here. I've got paint brushes that don't really matter, a little powder puff. I've got my color wheels. This is Graftobian. I've got some um, scar wax. Um, yeah, and then back here I have some glitters and an O oh, under here. Those two things, I have glitter, two glitter towers. Um, I have my Mayron palette here, a little um, cutting board. That's like a little flimsy cutting board I can use for. Um, this is a bag of flour for when I mix with latex. This is molding clay and uh, Vaseline and just random, a little color palette. Yeah. So that pretty much covers my Alex drawers. And then under my desk, I have this silver box. And I have my nail box there too. But this silver box has a lot more SFX stuff in it. And I just have some extra cotton balls on top. But I have all my SFX type, um, just all my like prosthetics are in there. My liquid latex, um, bloods, all kinds of weird little things that I use for my SFX stuff. It's all in that little kit. Yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed seeing a little sneak peek. This is my favorite drawer. And uh, yeah. If you have any requests for future videos or if you'd like to see any of these palettes like swatched or reviewed or anything like that, please let me know and I will. And I will talk to you guys on Monday.